Hello and welcome to the 14th episode of the Buckle Up Podcasts. You join your regular hosts, Jasper Bruce Wright, Harry George Foreman Grills, and Bobby Lee Wilson, or <laughs> Jasper Bruce Forsyth, apparently, <laughs> yes. Uh, we're here to talk about some stuff. A few things have happened in the last month. <laughs> this is a car podcast. Yeah, yep. We're is. a car YouTube channel. Because we're three white men, we also decided we needed a podcast. Yeah. So here we are. Um, we sat inside a Tesla uh, instead of a, in a recording studio because we just live life on the edge, baby. But yes, we will cover over what we've been up to for the past month and maybe talk about some things. Don't open the glove box. Good. <laughs> I... I mean, firstly, I, I'd just like to get it out there. I hate this car. <laughs> well, well, like, well, let's, it's, let's it's, not talk about the car too much because this is an audio podcast. Yeah. yeah. We're in a Tesla Model Y and it's none, of, none of us likes it. It's the best place to record an audio podcast because of all the acoustic glass. Yeah, not in this version. Yeah, no, oh, this, this no. is the noisy version. Oh, no. <laughs> That's anyway. the sound of an acoustic glass. It is. Um, what have we done in the last month? chaps well, quite, you, quite you, a lot you've done a lot of stuff <laughs> yeah yeah <laughs> where have i been have you been is you've did, been abroad twice yeah, yeah is milan yeah oh my god yeah right yeah so at the beginning of september i drove to um milan salami yeah um in a skoda superb oh the plug-in hybrid the mini cab of choice it is actually really nice. Yes. It is a very nice car. Um, so, yeah, I, I drove it from the north to Folkestone, Channel, a little bit of France, down to the Champagne region, Reims, Switzerland, yeah. Lake Lausanne, Alps, Furka Pass, not swear word, Italy, it does sound like one, though. Milan, Fly. Yeah, so you flew back. I did flew back, yeah. Because <laughs> you're far too important to drive back. Oh, yeah. Well, another group flew, uh, drove back. Yeah. They flew out and drove back. Yeah. Um, but it was very nice. I got to see some nice bits of the world. You got some irritatingly good photos of yourself yeah, and we Skoda had to, we had, as well. We had a professional photographer there. And yeah. I said, I would like some professional photographers of me, please. And they Rob, said yes. Rob's Instagram game has seriously stepped up in the last month. Why, <laughs> Just because of that. Why is the brightness bar moving around by itself? It'll be detecting the ambient lighting conditions and changing slightly. Where Where is the sensor? <laughs> It'll probably be what behind the wing mirror or the one in the centre of the dashboard, if there is one <laughs> back there. Somewhere. Oh, sorry, I'm sneezing. I'm I'm a little bit ill. Yeah. yeah so then Rob, also, Rob's... you've been you've been somewhere else with Skoda. I did go with Skoda to um, Prague the, to Prague Prague where mm. to see the new El Kid Rock. Rock. Yeah, Kid Rock, all summer long. Yeah. Um... Yeah, Skoda have a new electric car that's smaller than an Enyaq, mm. yeah, but bigger than an ID three. Yes. Somewhere in the middle there. Yeah. Uh, it's going to be like 31 grand though. So 31 and a half thousand pounds for 260 miles. That's and then the, good. the yeah. top spec one, which is 360 miles. So a hundred more Excellent. is like 38. So less than 40. It yeah. might be more like 39 by the time the conversion rate. I'm doing this on euros to pounds. Yeah. Obviously that's I'm, all subject to change. I'm assuming they're targeting just under 40,000 pounds Basically the top spec car is going to be less than 40. So you don't have to pay the additional tax yes yeah. um, very good of them which is quite good i mean to have um like a, a, a vw group electric car that's under 40 grand mm. that goes that far because do you remember when the id3 was over 40 grand yeah and, and it, it went was... 200 miles and you couldn't use the screen no oh, yeah those heady days <laughs> yeah I mean, like, if you think about it, though, when like, was that, that was, it was like three or four years ago. Oh, and, and that's very recent in my and, Yeah, And that's how far the technology has come on. Because the ID3 is like a good car that you would buy now. Yeah, yeah the facelifted ID3 that you two reviewed, you actually quite rated, really, didn't you? Well, well it was a car. They just made it a car. Like, <laughs> <laughs> it, was, it wasn't it was very what, good. You can watch how to set it to madness during the B-roll because we were quite bored filming yeah. that video. Yeah. But it was basically what it should have been when it first launched. Yes, exactly. Exactly that. They'd hit the nail on the head second time round. Yeah. After, I think that after I th the hammer had skipped off it first. Yeah. I think that the, the L-Rock uh, is also a good name. 
Yeah, mm. yeah, it's catchy. Because it, I, I, apparently it's because the Karok mm. is like that, and then L, like like they do E for the electric stuff, yeah. so Enyak and stuff like that. Oh, Kodiak, Kodiak. Enyak. Yeah, yeah, I yeah. didn't realise that. The only thing is L Rock sounds like a new... It could be L hyphen rock. It could be like a new yes. W. Yes, mm. yeah. The Rock. It's actually The it's, Rock. It is The Rock Dwayne. In, in Spanish. It is Dwayne The Rock Johnson. Yeah. Dwayne L Rock Johnson. Yeah. Fun fact, um, when I made the short about that, to make the, um, to make the automated voice fact. say L Rock correctly, when I put the text-to-speech in to make the voice get generated, I had to spell it C-K at the end. Yeah. And then in all of the captions, I had to go back and edit it so it was spelled correctly. Louis C.K. Can't yeah. mention him. Because otherwise, um, otherwise it said El Roque. And I was like... Mm. I was like Baroque. Yeah. yeah. Like, I, I like how like, Americans say yeah. Baroque. I was like, I Baroque. don't want the short to sound like that. So I had to type it as El Rock. Why do people put BMW wheels on Renault Kangoos? Not Kangoos. What Scenic. was that? Traffic. Traffic. The, Traffic yeah. yeah. There's a bloke at work who does that. <coughs> I mean, I assume Sorry. the bolt patterns must line up, but mm. but why? No, no one's fooled. Oh, no yeah. one's going to look at that and go, "Wow, look at that BMW." Well, to be fair, the cars that BMWs make nowadays, I would be fooled. The traffic's more attractive yeah. than I am. Like, oh, that's a good-looking BMW. That's good. That's good. Nice. I've always admired the rail traffic for the way, at some angles, it looks like it's wider at the top than it is at the bottom. Yes, like a Tudor house. Yeah. <laughs> The Renault Tudor house. <laughs> you, you, <laughs> they did a special edition with a thatched roof made yeah. of Watlin Dorb. Yeah. And then you could you could do the whole like blacked wood um black painted wood um Lincoln Blackwood, <laughs> the greatest special truck of all time. <laughs> No, you could do the, you could paint the whole wooden pattern on the outside of the van as well. Then, yeah, if you, but if don't put a bakery through. inside of one. Oh, oh no! <laughs> You'd have the great fire of don't, traffic. Don't put, don't park it on <laughs> Pudding Lane. Pudding Lane, yeah. There, I'm just going to put this headrest up because <clears throat> then Jerry Rafferty would write a song. Up, so I have it to lean on. About you, yeah. This so about seat. Red, is that song just about a Renault traffic? Yes, yeah, <laughs> yes. <laughs> Jerry Rafferty's one hit. <laughs> Uh, Baker Street, it was written about a Renault traffic setting on fire. <laughs> Thatched roof. So, uh, so, yes, this is a car podcast. It is. We're, We're talking about a Renault traffic. That's nearly a car. Nearly a car. It's nearly. definitely... I, 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 I film vans. That's what I've yeah, done Yeah, you do. You, you have. Anyway. Any way. Thank you. Oh, they can email in, actually. Yes. Speaking of the email. You can email. Where can email us, Jasper? Hello at buckleup-show.com. Lovely. So oh, so, so when so. he says it, it sounds like a reasonable email address. It does. But it's actually not. It's not. Why? It's really bad. <laughs> it's just like any too hyphen, much stuff. Any hyphen is too much. Well, we can look to change the web address. <laughs> no, anyway, it's no, no, it's fine. It's forever now. It's, it's fine. Um, so thank you um, for listening, watching, falling asleep to... Um, falling asleep at the wheel. Yeah. Don't do that. Yeah, no, don't We'd, do that. Buckle Up does not condone falling asleep at no. the wheel. Um... I actively discourage it. Yes. Yeah, same. Yeah, I I agree with you on that. This is not one financial of, advance. One, advice. Yeah, one of the few things I agree with you with. Um, and we'll see you... Listen to you. In the future. Speak yeah. to you. And next the past. Time. time is not linear. I watched Time's Interstellar a this week. I, I really want to go and watch Megalopolis. Oh, Megaflopolis. Megaflopolis. I, but do you not want to go and see Joker 2? No. Have you seen how bad the reviews of that They're are? not as bad as Mega, Mega Flopolis is. It's nearly as bad. Anyway. Like, it's really bad. Okay. Anyway. anyway thank bye. you very much. Bye. <laughs>